Hey guys, I'm Marty Geek and this video on show with all you Samsung smartphone users a little tip here on how to secure your internet browsing history by using a password or using your fingerprint. Of course, your finger uh, smartphone has to have the fingerprint scanner and um, uh, the reason I'm saying Samsung is because I'm using the Samsung browser which I think it's only exclusive for Samsung devices. That's why. So the thing is like every smartphone or every browser out there in the market has like a private mode or incognito mode if you're using um chrome browser so samsung calls it secret mode for example let's go ahead and give you an example here we are here in a website right let's say um you want to secure this right because if you go out right if you go out keep browsing and then just tap in again it will auto, it will still be in incognito mode and it will still be on the browser you know on the website that you were on <laughs> that's not going to protect you from that so to secure this all you got to do is either tap right here where it says more and go to settings and go to privacy and go to secret mode you can either go in that way or you could go in by when you're here right when you're here and, and turn uh in the secret mode right you could tap right here secret mode right there very fast and it'll It'll give you access right here which is the same way as going the long way so here we're going to use password going to click right there you're going to create a password at least four letters and above i'm going to go ahead and put um samsung like samsung just for the purpose of this video okay samsung and samsung there you go so now if i get out of the web browser right if i get out of the web browser and i try to go in again like you see there it will automatically tell me hey you need to enter your password that's a very cool mode like if you don't have a, a fingerprint so here i'm gonna go ahead and put yeah um here i'm gonna put samsung right do 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 samsung boom there you go we're in the browser that's good it's secured uh, nobody's going to be able to log into your um, browser history in the incognito mode if you have a password. Now, let's say you want to um, add a add um, the fingerprint. If your phone has a fingerprint, just click on. And of course, here is going to ask you again for the password that you put on first. Samsung. Boom. There you go. Now you're you're using the, your fingerprints. So if you go out of here again, let's go ahead and say we're out of here and we click in. Boom. It's going to ask you to enter your uh, fingerprint. Click right there. Voila. Just like that. And I can see there it works very, very smooth. I like the fact that it has that. Um, I, I don't think I've used I use incognito mode and Chrome browser, which is one of my favorite browsers. And I'm pretty sure it doesn't have this feature. Um, I did check it before I I did this video and I couldn't find this feature on that uh, on the browser. So, but this is very cool. You know, if you are a Samsung user and you want to secure your your um, browsing experience using a finger uh, fingerprint scanner or password, um, that's very very cool. So here, when you create, if you are in secret mode and you create another new tab, it's also going to be in secret mode. So it's like you see there, if I tap right here, if I go to Amazon, Amazon is going to be in secret mode. If I tap right here, I could switch between secret modes, um, tabs. That's very cool. That's very cool. I like that. Um, and of course, you could use this browser browser just to be in secret mode. Tap right there. Boom. Boom. That's it. Just like that. Uh, of course, if let's say some if, if you got this right, let's say this somebody closes this go there. It will go automatically to a normal mode, but it will it will it will not be in the in the website where you had your secret modes. Uh, so you tap right there, turn on secret mode. Okay, use password or fingerprint, and voila. Even to enter secret mode, it will also ask you for the password or fingerprint, which is very very good. And uh, you can also create like a bookmark as well. Like if I want to create a bookmark for Amazon in secret mode, I could just do that as well. Click here, right? And like you see here, the, anything that you save here will only be visible when you're in secret mode. Tap right there. Okay, tap right there. And that's it. You have that on secret mode. So when you tap right there, boom. 
you should be in secret mode there so that's it guys just wanted to share this video with you guys just in case you didn't know that you can actually use your fingerprint or your password to protect your browsing history thanks for watching the video guys if i find a um another a browser that works with every smartphone i will definitely make a video for that or if you know of a browser that actually can do this on any smartphone let me know in the comments and i'll try to cover it as well thanks for watching the video guys till next time